We are taking questions from across the country and our next caller Deepayan Chaudhary is joining us for a question on Bangalore, buying a property there. Go ahead Deepayan, how can we help you? Yeah, hi ma'am. Uh, I'm planning to buy a 2 BHK apartment in Bangalore and I have shortlisted the Kholte Patil Uttar Raga uh, project for this. Mm -hmm. So my query is, is this a good decision to buy an apartment over there in the Hen Road side? And uh, suppose if I need to sell that uh, flat in near future, will I be getting a good, uh, good price for that? All right, so Hinu Road is already a very hot micro market of Bangalore. There's Manita Tech Park, isn't it? So, a lot of residential demand. What do you think? It's uh, future potential? Yeah, I think you can go ahead with it because if you look at the price, 3650 is the price of phase one, whereas the weighted average price of that market is about 4,500 rupees a square mm -hmm. foot. This is also located at Kunur Road, just off Hunur Main. It's a uh, Kolte uh, Patil, so Hunur it's a Pune Main company Road. in yeah. Bangalore. Yeah. But with very good uh, track record. Very good track record. And uh, the development is coming with a Khata, CC and OC. And the project is coming up in two phases. Kolte Patil, as you mentioned, is a Pune-based developer, but has now got good projects in Bangalore as well and has got a good track record. Considering his budget and location, we are recommending two more projects. One in Hinu Road, which is MMS Habitat by MMS Builders. This is 3,800 rupees a square foot. Located again off Hinu Road, uh, seven kilometers from Manita Tech Park. Excellent infrastructure near proximity. Uh, this has got a 3,000 square feet clubhouse with a gym, pool, etc. And one project in Thani Sandra, Footprints, Galaxy Developers. This is 2016 completion year. This project is offering amenities like clubhouse, comprising of gymnasium, expensive landscape lawns. Eastern Mall is just seven kilometers away. Uh, this is a G plus two, uh, G plus 12 uh, building and uh, seven blocks and land area is a total of two acres. Mm -hmm. And the price, we've already shown, shown the market data, but price trends of these two markets, which is Henu Road and Thani Sandra, seems like Henu Road has done a little bit better. Absolutely, Sunil, right? Henu, uh, Henu Road is about 10% analyzed and Thani Sandra is uh, about 8%. An inventory overhang is safe in both markets, 22 and 21 months. Hmm. So not so inventory overhang, as we've discussed before, is the pace at which sales are taking place. Uh, if it's over 24 months, we always say it's a little bit worrying, but otherwise, both the price, both these markets seem to be in a safe zone, and price appreciations we've just shown. Projects, of course. Uh, let's just bring up the summary of the projects recommended for uh, the pine in Bangalore's Hinur market and also Thani Sandra, MMS Habitat and Footprints. All right, uh, we've got one more email to cover and this one has come from Hyderabad. Uh, just let's quickly get you this one. Gopal Putrevu writes in and he says, uh, is Hira Nandani, Shankar Pali, Hyderabad, a good investment option for an apartment at 2,600 rupees per square foot? I'm looking for an investment purpose, nearby areas to Shankar Pali. Shankarpali is really far off. I mean, it's way outside the center of Hyderabad, 40 kilometers from the high-tech city. But the fact that uh, Hiranandani Group is coming out with a township project, there must be a lot of uh, pull there, isn't it? Yeah, this is actually a 65-acre township project uh, and it's got plots, villas and high-rise apartments and Hiranandani's have always actually tried to come out with big townships and created destinations like they've done in Pawai and now they're trying to do it in Panvel as well. So uh, we are recommending better location, Nala Gandla and Miyapur as uh, micro markets that uh, you could consider. Although we give, give a go ahead because it's a Hiranandani project in Shankarapalli also, uh, the pricing is quite reasonable, 2600 rupees a square foot. 25 acres of this will be developed into future commercial and social developments in this project. Coming to the weighted average price of this mid-segment market, uh, Mayapur is 3050 and Nala Gandla is 3250 rupees a square foot. There are not too many comparables in uh, this part of the city, which is Shankarapalli. So weighted average price will also be kind of not accurate over there as there are very few projects. Uh, there are significant educational institutes over there and coming to the recommendations from our side, uh, if you have uh, Miyapur as one Eco Valley by Srija Builders and Developers, this project is spread over 1.5 acres. Uh, under construction work is uh, happening at this point in time and infrastructure is reasonably good. Uh, it's two kilometers from the international school. Bonsai Homes uh, in core infrastructure, Dala Gandla, this is 3150 rupees a square foot. This project is divided into three phases across four towers. 
and this project is located on Kanchi Gachibali Road in Nalagandla. Building plans are approved and approved by all the top banks. Infrastructure is also reasonably good. All right, Gopal. So here it is. You get a go ahead on the Hiranandani project township in Shankarpali in Hyderabad. Then there are also other recommendations. They're nowhere close to the market that you've chosen. But because it's an investment, we've decided to give you the best markets in your budget of 30 to 35 lakhs. Two projects, Eco Valley and Bonsai Homes. Go ahead and take a look at it. Uh, well, that's a wrap on the property show with this solution. Now we'll be back again to resolve your queries and get you up to date with everything that affects your home buying and selling. You can reach out to us with your questions on, of course, uh, property at NDTV.com or Facebook and Twitter. Goodbye from Samir and me.